Gold and Tokwa. Well, I hope you all enjoyed that episode recap of season one, episode nine, Brief Candle. I really enjoyed this episode myself because I love how these episodes sort of take us back in time and it's interesting going and seeing the Argosians as like, you know, they're the reminding they're reminding me of um, like you know ancient Rome, ancient Greek style. So it's so it's really nice to see that in a sort of setup. And Kinthia is a very beautiful woman, and Jack's a bit like Kirk in that respect. So he always gets the attention of the beautiful women, and they are drawn to him. So um, yeah, he he ends up having a night with her, which is also very interesting. But what I um, like about this episode is I've been reading the Illustrated Companion, and a little bit of it says. I'll read it to you guys. Um, Newman also thought it was going to be a bit of a strange getting the actor who's not normally associated with inactivity to stay put for a length of time it took to apply the makeup. So he's talking about Richard Dean Anderson. He says, usually I can only pin Richard down for around seven minutes, but he was so intrigued by the whole old age procedure that it wasn't a problem at all. Taking the prosthetics off was the worst part. It took around two hours per day. By that time, Mitchell was getting real antsy. As on set producer, Michael Greenberg acknowledges Anderson's professionalism during the filming of the episode. It was very hard for Rick because of that makeup. He was being prepared for camera for anything between four and six hours every day. That has to be rough. But I also respect him for his incredible performance from the piping voice to the stoop and shuffle. He did a wonderful job. So... I think Richard Dean Anderson is a spectacular actor and when you realise that when actors film TV series like this, you know, they're working anywhere to like 10 months out of the year, 13 hour days and when they're having things like, you know, these um, prosthetics done if they're, you know, if they're injured or they have something like this, you know, you obviously see it in Star Trek and all the other sci-fi series are to make them look that a little bit different or alien or etc. And then, you know, you don't realise that how long it does actually take for them to go on. And, you know, could you imagine yourself being sat in a, in a chair at five in the morning and you're having all this prosthetics put onto your face and then six hours later it's done and then it's like, right, you're on set now, you've got to go do your scene. I mean, I bet, I bet it was... Yeah, I can imagine it being quite strain, strainful, so to speak, and quite tedious. Um, but at the end of the day, like the, like the guy said, Greenberg, um, Richard Dean Anderson did an incredible performance, even when he got into the old age section of the episode. I thought it was fabulous. So, yeah, I hope all you guys enjoyed that recap. And join me tomorrow as I post the merchandise opening. So look out for that tomorrow. I'll be doing my normal one quiz question at the end of this week as well. So keep an eye out for that, guys, as well. So join me on an adventure through the gate. And I await you on the merchandise opening. Thank you. Bye.